he, he's become almost like a uh, like a phantom or a, like urban legend in the bodybuilding community. Trevor was 400 pounds. on level. Just like he was a fourth degree black belt in Goshen Buddha Jiu Jitsu, he studied in Japan. He wasn't just somebody who studied a little bit here. He took everything to a very high level. He studied it so much, he was, you know, ready to go and he had so much knowledge and that was it. <laughs> techniques the turn of standard him string curl into more of a stiff legged deadlift applying constant tension you know people make the mistake of thinking it's a curling motion that builds but there's three to four weak points that are inherent in that movement that I eliminate by pausing and with a crack above the weight stack Relaxing the leg, and then slowly, slowly dragging out of the hole. Which is why, even if I don't get to the top part of the movement, because the entire hamstring, we have the continuous tension the entire time. And I now only get a total, including the drops, of six reps, and I don't do any force reps. But it fucking destroys your hamstrings. It's slightly more than an average housewife and a lot less than an average mountain girl. But the packages that I use and you see me using are all done post pre exhaust. And, uh, you know, not that I compare myself to powerlifters, but the packages are certainly in their league and in excess of their league in certain instances. It's a different type of strength. And uh, I get a, big, get a big kick out of people who uh, think that my training system can't make them stronger. But uh, when I get to the instructional part of the video series, you know, I can give you more scientific reasons and equations as to why Beyond Failure Training is basically a compilation of powerlifting, volume training, high intensity training, all rolled into one. And a guarantee of stimulating every muscle fiber, which most people, in fact, I know none of them actually do. You think he's a sadistic son of a bitch? Oh, he's, he's the most sadistic bastard I've ever met. knowledge, his martial arts knowledge, his training knowledge, and he created a system called Beyond Failure Training. And because he was so strong, he wanted to create a training system where you would pre-exhaust not to ruin your ligaments and tendons, because he just couldn't, he couldn't get enough weight on the, on the equipment. For him, he, he wanted to hit 400 pounds before he hit the stage. That was his goal, to hit 400 pounds and strip off and be probably about 375 to hit the stage.
knows that you never, you never reach the level of mastery. You never, you're training up until the day you die. 